Smith Machine single leg lunge tap. Um, she's only she only has one arm up right now because her right shoulder is injured, but she keeps her one leg that's in the front stationary and her knee stays over her toes. Second and it's in line with her second and third toe. She lunges straight down, squeezes her core, keeps her back tight, and she's tapping. This is really good for glutes and hamstrings. We're using the assisted pull-up and um, dip machine, and we're using it for glute press down. So she has her foot in the center and it's straight. She's pressing down, actually using more force in her heel, and she's squeezing her glutes and her hamstrings. She's doing half range of motion, but usually you can come up a little bit higher. I just have her focusing more on her glutes and hamstrings today. Seated leg curl, this is for hamstrings. I actually uh, modify this a little bit with Yolanda. I have her sit forward and keep her back straight. Um, she's using her core and her lower back to stay stabilized. And then her range of motion is a little bit deeper because instead of sitting back on the seat and having her feet um, come to here, she's actually having her feet basically come all the way under her glutes. This is for hamstrings. And if you do it this way, it'll also work your glutes, your lower back and your lower core. Seated leg press. I have Yolanda doing single leg stuff today because she has muscle atrophy, so I'm trying to even it out. Um, with the single leg press, this is working for her hamstrings and her glutes. She said she also feels it in her adductors and her vastus lateralis. She is pushing through her heel and she's keeping her knee in line with her second and third toe, squeezing at the top. These are curtsy squats. She's squatting in the center, curtsy squat. I don't really know how to explain this to you guys on a video, but if you watch her form, you can figure it out. Just make sure that when you're doing your squat, your knees are out. Um, keep your back straight and your core tight as much as you can, and keep it low. Drop it low. Work those glutes. Work those hamstrings. Uh, the further you do your side lunge, the more you're going to pull into your hamstrings. 